Right, game number one, positive against Necro, which I nearly went with. So, um, he has gone with no fleshies. Uh, no fleshies, okay, so three rerolls, no fleshies. I've done this kind of start before. That's absolutely fine. Probably the most competitive, really, at 1000 TV. Because you get the rerolls and all your, all your good players. Because fleshies are a bit overcosted, aren't they, really? 110k for a Black Hawk at rookie, at rookie TV. Um, I do shit on Bretonians a bit, I at all, but they obviously got a lot better when they uh, gave them agility access. So, yeah, maybe I don't, but I just didn't have tackle. That was the thing. I was sorely lacking tackle on the Nurgle team. I had three tackle on the Chaos. As it happened, of course, the Chaos rock bashed by Wood Elves in the, <laughs> the semi-final, so maybe the Nurgle would have done better. But, um, rats are probably done now. Uh, probably done. I guess I'm trying to win, aren't I? So kicking is kicking is the best for winning. Oh, the Trident. The tried and true Trident. Coming out to play. Actually, I don't even need to do a trident. I could do, could do this, couldn't I? Could do the Jimmy Fantastic Space Invader. Yeah, I lost this last game in game. Yeah, Morgan's. I, I tried to win Ari in it and and got punished. <laughs> True, Ducky, but I just think for a starting team, it, it, it's it's better, cause, you know, because you get the three re-rolls and, I don't know. Yeah. Uh, unfortunately, Harold Meyer, um, I didn't, I don't think so. Um, I don't remember typing it in. I do, but I try to fit in everyone. You know, I don't know what, what when you uh, when you asked. I'm, sorry. I'm not stealing his formations. Yeah, there was some, there was some, there was some bad dice in this game. Yeah, yeah. It, you know, I don't like, I don't like to say that I was diced, um, but it was, it was certainly tough. <laughs> it is just anti strength three frenzy. That's what the formation is. Anti strength three frenzy. This is uncanny Davos lawyer, maybe. No, I'm not I'm not trying to qualify with Dark Elves. It's just I've gotta to play two more games today. So I'm gonna play two games today. I don't need a, I don't need a strength four in the corner anyway, Jelly. I don't need to anyway. Was he the first to ask? I didn't even fucking say. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I just didn't see. Ooh! Le Double Skulls. That's good, isn't it? Yeah, it's, it's against Strength 3 Frenzy. That's what it's for. That's all it's for. It's pretty hard for the Blitz with a Wolf now, isn't it? able to but he's giving up a block with block on his wolf isn't he unless he blitzes that blitzer off which he's not going to do so he's getting his wolf hit by block which is good isn't it should be a death if my games with necro or anything to go by 
I can't believe he didn't do the classic 3 plus dodge away without a reroll. Yeah, so I'll play two games a day with these Dark Elves. And then uh, and then just think about whether to go Necro or Dark Elves. Or like, what, what serious team? Like, Necro are good in that you can go with them late in the season. Because if you're down TV, you get a Wizard, which you can use quite well. And you get Chainy, which is brilliant. So... I really don't mind waiting to uh, to go for the the necro run uh, if you know if I wanted to actually try to qualify with necro. I don't mind waiting a little bit. So as it and I just I just prefer dark elves. So go dark elves. Eh? Why not? not going to blitz with this wolf or is he going to one dice blitz one dice into an uphill or is he just going to let me hit his wolf what, what's he going to do he's he's going frenzy trap block but gets a power and a removal no unbelievable Jeff. Oh, Base, base, base. This I actually hit the ball here, couldn't I? I? Could block him, push him to there, push him out, block him, and then hit the ball. So I could actually hit the ball here. It would stop me hitting a. It would stop me hitting a wolf. And it'd only be a one dice in the ball anyway, so. Got him. Nothing. Yeah, he can blitz him to keep everyone safe. Oh, I say everyone safe. Everyone. Everyone uh, not. Not based. That was underwhelming, wasn't it? I'll keep quite tight and wolves are a bit dominated, aren't they? I mean, in theory, both dogs are knocked over because it was pretty easy to knock them over, wasn't it? And then, uh, yeah, my world was rarely be more under. Yeah, that was a very underwhelming. I really was hoping to, to at least stun one. Uh, you know, the chance of them both going down was pretty high. Chance of breaking armor on armor eight with two tries is pretty high, so there's a good chance of at least stunning one, and a decent chance of knocking out one. Wouldn't have been crazy to have knocked one out. <laughs> that sounds that sounds rude, doesn't it? <laughs> if you don't know, in England, uh, knocking one out means uh, well, you can probably work it out. <laughs> so. <laughs> Yep, he's, he hasn't blitzed with them, but he's going to go for the dodges. Fails. We all failing a dodge? The fuck is this? He likes giving up hits, doesn't he? I only have two rerolls, so... Getting a lot of punches isn't 
as good as it could be with some other teams. Crazy dodge from him. So he's knocked out, and and that's fair enough, isn't it? That's kind of that's kind of fair enough. He's had three armor rolls on armor eight, and uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah. So I can two dice him. I could blitz to two dice here, but then I'd rather blitz him. But then I can't. I can't do a one dice to try and get the assist for him. Um. So he can two dice. This lad can two dice this lad. Um, he can go there. And go here to just kind of play it safe a little bit with these guys. Unfortunately, I've got to make the unsafe block before I make the blitz, unless. Could one in thirty six round here? No. Push is good enough, so I can still move him in there. Move the witch elf here. So I've done done good safe moves first here. Very good safe moves first. Um this is the le this is the least bad failure state, I guess, isn't it? So I can go that first, and also it gives us the the two dice with block after it. Now maybe I could have stood here so I could push him into two tackle zones. Would have been risky though in case of a push, so yeah, I was probably right. And clear him as well. Glorious. There, yeah, so we can't assist. Kaz, oh, amazing! Giving up blocks for no reason, punished. Outrageous, outrageous. Still, obviously there, so they can't get friendly. But still, blocking. Yeah, kind of parallel. Pretty good, pretty good turn. I think this positive, posit positivity is paying off with uh, Dark Elves so far. Maybe he's crap and that's why it's paying off. But maybe it's the attitude, you don't know. Um, maybe it is the power of positivity. Who knows? Base moves first. <laughs> uh, what's this? Let, let me have a look at this. I caught this video by um, Canal. <laughs> yeah, you should just be off screen. Yeah, it's true risk development. That is the that is the uh, the bad thing about that video, isn't it? Yeah. Um. Yeah, no escape and no fucked uh, federal. Pretty much. Frenzy trap into a one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Positive is for fairies. Don't know about that, Hero Poro. I don't know. <laughs> it's not grown man stuff. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, it's funny, isn't it, Machina? It is funny of all the races to have as team positive Necro uh, Dark Elves is quite funny, isn't it? <laughs> exactly, yeah, pan <laughs> pancakes. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> exactly. Right, so we've got more blocks at potential. One dice on the ball. Push him to there. Push him. I only potential one dice on the ball, I think. <laughs> yeah. Um, 
wide. So these are too far away to get in for the assist. So I guess this guy has to do it. Um. <laughs> no, it's not Pedro, but yeah, come on, let his go up, fine. Right, so block him first. If it's a push, block him with him as well. Um, where does the blitz come? Here, maybe? Or here? I don't want to base... I don't want to leave these guys out here, though, either. So maybe he's come back to the middle? Ish. I guess these two do just base. Because... Why not? Wolfie survives. <laughs> uh, so now this guy can probably go here. The witch elf can stay here. Can put him block. And then leave the guy in contact, but leave him in contact with three players. Didn't, I didn't actually click there, did it? That was just si clicking too fast. And Sinai being complete fuck-ups. So that's, that's something. Maybe I should have put these guys behind the uh, directly behind the allies in case of wolf blitzes. Would have been something. Oh, it's a shame. Power there would have been great, wouldn't it, to base all three down guys. Put him in contact with three as well. But yeah, he's going to get a blitz around this corner, maybe I should come more over here. But he could also go around this corner, so I think it's okay. Two players up is outrageous, isn't it? Yeah, this game got banged on lag XC. Yeah. So yeah, maybe I could have put the Blitzer in to the LOS and then the lineman out to hang out. Maybe that's what I should have done. Two Dark Elf teams can qualify, that's true. That's true. Obviously you, you would rather pick a race with less competition though if you can. Like it doesn't make sense to, to try to qualify with a contested race, does it? So. Opponent didn't even have block. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I guess that was maybe my fault that Blitzer going down there. Uh, the money games. Oh, I was making the G fight stop the surf. Is there something I can do? Not really, I'd have to fill in the square. Really. What a good matchup for Delta Q, isn't it? Raw TV, anything. At high TV, not a lot. <laughs> I think I just blitz this guy. And then, you know, squeeze him. I want to do the blitz first to see if it's a pal or what it is. It is a pal. KO, very lucky. So going here and here completely sh completely shuts down his sideline play. So now I've just got to think about stopping him cutting back through the field, which this and this should help with. He can go in there, something 2D, 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 potentially. There's one. 
There's another one. And there's the last one. Outrageous. Outrageous. Look, I don't want to follow because obviously I get hit by him. Because he, he really committed here, didn't he? No. Did not base the ball. I could have done. Could have based the ball. Because, you know, he's only one in, he's a 1 in 9 to fail rather than 1 in 36. Much better to base against a, uh, a nudge 3 guy than a nudge 4 guy. But, um, Yeah, armor eight and four blocks, yeah exactly. Yeah. It's crazy, isn't it, Norway? I'm confused too. Yeah, I guess I guess the rest of Elman, yeah, that's a good point. That is a very good point. But then what are your other elf yeah, what are your other elf choices? Like Pro L's with three rolls, but then armor sevens, they get loads of guys removed. So yeah, I think I value block over rerolls personally. Yeah. I think. I mean, the Dark Elf start is a bit rough. I mean, the best Elf team for beginners is Wood Elves, I guess, just because they're fucking overpowered. But then they might make loads of leaps, mightn't they, with their war dancers that maybe they shouldn't make and stuff, so. Oh, I should be able to get two dice on the uh, on the ghoul this turn, eh? Well, apart from they just don't have the movement to get there. Um, he could go there to assist, he could two dice, then he could two dice. Then he could to there to there. He could go in here. Oh, no, some, no, he could have to go in there. They could two dice to here and here. And I could only get a one dice at the ball. With block. Might be worth it. Which elf can be the sweeper? Right, these are a bit shit over here, but I just want to see what these are. I can use a reroll this turn. Follow here, yeah, and then don't follow on the next one. Mm, I think I just go here. I think. I right, guess I could have blocked him first, then based him. That would have probably been better. I just want to go for the one, one -er. one -er on the ball, oh, GFI to one dice. Yeah, okay, do this block first then. Yeah, if I'd saved him, I could have come somewhere else. One -er to G GFI to one -er. I might as well, I think it's all right. Put him further away. From the in zone. <laughs> yeah, let them not take assassins yet. Yeah. Yeah, so maybe I left it, let, let him go back there. Maybe I should have done that block first. And then if it was a power, I could have put the Dark Elf, the Blitzer there, couldn't I? Oh. Oof. How's he going to protect the ball, though, with a wolf? Do 
does he know about my sheet? Is that is that why he's made this move? Maybe he knows about the sheet. Mm. Got a couple of GFIs to make it safe. Read the paper. <laughs> Unless I can chain. Chain them forward. Lock there, come around to here. One, two, three, four, five, six. GFI. Lock it. I can't get someone in there. Getting them in here would be the hard part, wouldn't it? But then I could chain him, chain him onto there, block him, and then surf the ball would be good, wouldn't it? That would be re that would be really nice, but getting someone in here is the prob problem. He could, he could block him, pal. One, two, three, four, five, six. Double GFI to get in. And then I would also have to fill these two up as well. One, two, three, four, five, six. It's, it's too many GFIs. But that would be great, though, wouldn't it, to, uh, to fill these three spots up and then block him into there, into there, into there, pow him, and then surf the ball. But... Probably asking a bit too much to do all that. Maybe I could do this block first and still do it. Can I do this block and then still do that? Maybe I could. Um, he blocks him. He comes into here. He goes one, one, two, three, four, five, six. GFI. Then I just need two places in here and these two as well. No, it's really too hard now. Really too hard. He can make two GFIs. Or he could make... Him, him just getting him in first without any GFIs and then him making two is better, isn't it? dodge there for what it's worth that's the only dice roll I've failed so far <laughs> don't surf could have made that block with block first and then move this guy that was really I guess I really should have made this block and then move this guy as well so I fucking made I played shit there. I did play shit. I could have surfed this guy back out the back after getting that knocked down. I could have blocked there, he could have come in here. And then I could have surfed this one. No, not really. There was no excuse for not making the 1 in 36 block, was there? I should have made that block 100%. And then maybe just moved him to there to control him. Don't know. But yeah, this was really bad not making that block. That was pretty unlucky, that, wasn't it? Need this. Yeah, the Skaven aren't retired, but um, I think they're done. Should not have made the surf, should I? Should have not tried for the surf. <laughs> I've got a sheet that says no surfs. I didn't look at it. I tried to surf. If I just blitz with a blitzer, it would have been better. I shouldn't have. I shouldn't have fucking done it. I shouldn't have. There was no need. I could have just blitz with a blitzer. I should have just blitzed the werewolf with a blitzer, and then I could have had a screen, and he would not have scored. I think. Mean, I think it was the wrong. Ah, well, it's a werewolf. You've got to try a serpent, haven't you? Haven't you got to? I think you got to try to surf him. Yeah. There wasn't a need to be fancy, but it's surfing, it was it was high risk making two two pluses. Just 
Just go for the frenzy trap. Three plus. We've been three plus with a reroll instead of two pluses. But yeah, maybe I would have probably just rolled the power anyway. Yeah. Mm. <sighs> All right, what do I do here? I mean, I want to make safe blocks, but then also I just want to fucking score, don't I? So. I just don't care about making them LOS blocks. Seeing as these are my movement seven guys. That makes scoring good. There in case of a blitz, have to be occupied, don't we? I mean, it wasn't that fancy, was it? I mean, that wasn't fancy. That was just an easy serve to serve the wolf. Like, serve a really important player. But yeah, it wasn't as good for stopping the score. It wasn't, was it? It just wasn't. Interesting, isn't it? One, two, three, four, five, six. I'd like to hand off to him, wouldn't I? And uh, get him safe. Now, unfortunately, there's no real way base, to get base, him base. safe. This won't fail. I'm on the right. Burr, burr, burr. Giving him a block here sucks. He's also really fast. I think I have to do it, though. I think I have to just get these guys based up. Get a canoring threat that side. And go there, one, two, three, four, five, six. Do a, two GFIs there, isn't it? And then I can also do a handoff next turn if I get the chance. <laughs> high risk. It was high risk. Yeah, it was too high risk. But then, you know, it was it was it was high risk, high reward, wasn't it? So there was the problem. If I if I don't go here, he's just done three plus to come through and one dice me with a reroll. Um. He's got a dodge, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, double GFI, dodge, double GFI to hit. If I go here, then, um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, I'm not ahead of him, so it's still two, 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 two pluses to score. Um, I think that's the safest way, isn't it? I could also just uh, I could also just make a dodge instead of this block and then get there. Mm. Yeah, so now it's a two plus to score if he doesn't take him. Yeah. Maybe I should have put the witch elf on the LOS for that reason. Yeah, but having getting hit by claw is a bit crap, isn't it? And just getting getting my witch elf hit there for no reason because I was going to block. I was going to block with the LOS guy, and now now I'm letting the witch elf get hit, which is a bit crap. Alright, fair enough then, Leon. <laughs> you should have a look at the top bolts here. 
Hot wind blew blow along the sentinels. Mm hmm. Yeah. But, you know, when it's to remove a werewolf. It's, uh, but he's a rookie one, so maybe I shouldn't have done that. I mean, I had an easy way to make it very hard for him to score, didn't I? But I went for the high risk, high reward. He's not even trying to score, stop us now. No, it's uh But he did I did I did give this block up unnecessarily. Will I be punished with death? No. Unbelievable Jeff. No, the surf to take wasn't the white. Because if I'd surf the white, I'm not I'm not getting in front of the ball. Surfing him, I'm, I'm basing the carrier in front of him. He's got no way to fucking get forward. I was trying, I was stopping the score as well, wasn't that? That was the thing. So surfing the white would have been shit. <laughs> because it's not, it's not helping in either, in either, in any fashion then, is it? Surf the wolf. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. No. I could have, I could have blitzed him back and then blocked with a, him. Yeah, I could have surfed him. But, I just want to, uh, I just want to go for the bits of squad. In terms of removal, but in terms of removal wasn't, you know, didn't matter then, did it? I wanted to, I was trying to stop the score as well. But anyway, okay, so letting him score didn't, didn't matter in the end. But, um, no, I mean, I wasn't just going for damage. I, it was the fact that I was going to, if I'd surfed his wolf, I'm, uh, I didn't have a block guy there, Carl Winchelot. Mine was the statistically better play. <laughs> statistically better play. No, I could have actually. No, because if I'd. Maybe I could have handed off to the guy. Maybe I could have handed off the blitzer and then blitzed with him. But then it both down would have made an additional GFI. I don't know. The Skaven are pretty dead, yeah. I guess the Skaven are dead. Um. Yeah, the block. I could have. I could have done the handoff first, and then blitzed, needing a pow. I don't know. I prefer just block. Just blocking for the push with without block, and then one two plus to score. I think. I think mine was the best play. But yes, obviously, I could have tried it different ways. There's more than one way to skin a cat. Protect against the blitz a little bit, don't you? The inevitable blitz. This is good apart from I don't want to follow, so I'd have to bring in another guy. With the runners of alignment, not this build, no. No, because this build has the Witch Elf instead of the Blitzer. So you can you can go four Blitzers plus alignment, or you can go three Blitzers plus a Witch Elf. Or you can just go four Blitzers um, and no runner, which is what I would do. <laughs> I don't know how it's going to come to me, so I can't answer that question. Safe moves first. It's outrageous, this isn't it? I don't know what, I don't know what stream this is. <laughs> Making safe moves first. Outrageous. Well, yes. That no, I could still get it done though, couldn't I? I mean, I would just hack at it and stuff, and and somehow skin it. it might not be very pretty, but if if my life depended on skinning a cat, it would get skinned. <laughs> right. I want a blitz the white, don't I actually? So that works out quite well for making safe moves first. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep. 
<laughs> uh, I don't want to blitz and have to reroll, but I guess I'm just going to blitz and then... It's in a bit of trouble if... Oh, so I'm going to have to reroll this, maybe. Let's see. Did not even have to reroll. So that makes it pretty safe to the point where I don't have to reroll the pickup. And even successfully succeeded. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, GFI, GFI. Let me just go here. Maybe this guy was a bit irrelevant. Lyman is going to get Frenzy Clawed, but at least he's a lineman. Um, it's not the end of the world, is it? I can't exactly stop any blitz at this point, can I? Uh, Got to keep the ball. Shame that the Witch Elf won't, get, won't be getting skilled up this game. But what can you do, eh? I guess I could have had these guys one for it. Yeah, it gets cards perfect. Um, I guess these guys could have been one forward, and then it'd have been a bit harder for them to do that. Mully D, hello. Um, I've been given the PC tips and tricks out for all dice. Uh, no, I'm very not good at rolling dice, unfortunately. That is my weakness in this game. It's the dice on the dice roll in front. Alive and already dead, that's already two ways. Wow, brutal, brutal Adonis cards. Right, so he's giving up a block for no reason, and he's giving up a surf. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, double GFI, very risky, probably uses my last reroll, but my last reroll, one reroll, but I have to go for it, I have to make this block first to see if this guy is under control. He's not. So but at least I know that now. I mean, I have to go for this guy. I just have to. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. GFI, GFI. No, I can't do that till afterwards. But afterwards, I go in there and here. Gotta go for it, haven't I? Just got him. Yeah, I could actually sideline cage rather than go for it back. Yeah. That is safer, isn't it? As horrible as a sideline cage is, it's literally safer. No need to roll dice. Well done. Thanks, Shattered Ice, <laughs> for being better than me. <laughs> um, right. get a system there or an assist in there. I think I just get punched. Realistically, I think I just get punched. Because he, he hasn't got blocked.
Yes, exactly, exactly. Shadow dice. That was it, wasn't it? That was better to. Uh, there was no dice rolls needed. I think it was better to get here, you know, and have him there. I think that's a much better board state to have, because now he can't he can't knock this guy over, and he can't you know roll a six to surf me and stuff. But it was risky, wasn't it? To make two two plus rolls. <laughs> He's gonna cage dive. <laughs> He's gonna do the cage dive surf. Thirty percent to surf me, ish. Not even that bad. Yeah, it's not even bad. Is it? It's not even bad. So that was the. I hate sideline cages. I really hate sideline cages. But um. Lucky, luckily, he was out, yeah. Hey! Um, so I could hit him and just dodge with dodge, but then it's a 1 in 36. However, if I blitz, I can blitz, just blitz and run away, can't I? So yeah, I blitz and run away. God, thank God it wasn't a thank God it wasn't a both down. Yeah, I just run back now. Keep uh, that guy based. I don't want him to get served, so I guess I just don't get him served. <laughs> that seems a good idea, doesn't it? You can't surf him, he can only pin him inside right I guess not him getting surfed is more important than him maybe knocking that guy down. Okay. Not bad. Not bad. I know, I know, calm down. <laughs> <laughs> Against and he's obviously wouldn't be. This is this is bad though that he gets clawed, isn't it? Cast. Okay, only badly hurt. Two cars. Lucky that they were both only badly hurt. Positive, on the positive side. <laughs> I mean, he's got more guys out as well. I really want to be able to blitz his wolf. And the best way of doing that is by this hit, isn't it? You can see why I wanted to fucking surf that wolf earlier, can't you? Unfortunately, protecting the ball is a little bit tricky. I've got to re-roll the one in nine. Do you know what? I should have put, put the assist in there and then blocked and stood this guy up afterwards. <laughs> uh, I mean, here is alright, isn't it? But then here means. One, two, three, four, five, six, and then a dodge after doing this block. And if this block is a 1 in 81, I'm in a bad place. It wasn't. Mm. 
Now this this guy being down made made things a lot trickier. Obviously, if he wasn't there, it would have been an easy cage, a nice safe cage. As it is, it's two plus to make a cage. Outrageous! Didn't fail. Unbelievable, Jeff. Unbelievable. Yeah, Necro with no fleshes. Yeah, not not very good, really. <laughs> like I can see why you min max get gets your best player, all your best players in at a thousand TV, but really lacking strength. And the stand firm is actually really good against stuff like Dark Elves. Third edition dead idea. Yeah. Yeah. Block doing something. Just run away from those two. Ghouls, uh, zombies in a four plus, can't I? Could do a huge foul here as well, which I'm liking the look of. Three, four, five, six, seven. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck I'm doing here. Oh shit. God, huge AB break. Huge AB break. Zero assist foul. Should probably think about scoring as well, shouldn't I, at some point? Really fucked it there, didn't I? That was a really, really horrible, horrible, horrible. I should have just pushed him away and actually got a good assist foul in. Rolled an eight as well. So if I'd got if I'd got some assists on, I'd have been all right. It's just that he's he's killing all my guys. You know, this wolf is killing all of my guys, and I just thought I've won. I need to not have my guys killed, but I really haven't won because there's two turns left. Um. So I, it was it was a great foul, Squirrel Dude, because I was purely only caring about taking attrition. So it was, it was great for what I wanted it to do. Greed is good. Greed is right. No, no, I, I just did it because I, I'm only, I think I've won. I literally thought I've won this game. I just need to not get killed by anyone else killed by this wolf. That's all it was. It wasn't because I thought I could have got a big one at all. It was just literally. You know. Count out those squares. Like I should have done, but I didn't. One, two, three, four, five, six, GFI, GFI. And we've got here coming. Got a reroll here. So. <laughs> yeah, maybe I could have done done a better screen. Yeah, I mean, 
mean, it wasn't. Yeah, it's fine. Whatever. That was the thing, wasn't it? It was basically a, it was just a foul to stop the wave of killing anyone. A chance of him not killing anybody. So yeah, I didn't care about the pitch removal. All I cared about was a stun. Basically, every gym foul. Yeah. No, I was I was aware that it wasn't a great odds thing or anything. But literally didn't care. Yeah, I could have, I could have done lots of. So yeah, stun, a stun was a cas really, wasn't it at this point? There's only a few, yeah. But yeah, I mean, I shouldn't, I shouldn't have got greedy with a hit on the one on the ghoul. I just thought, oh, I can get an extra hit on the ghoul, and I shouldn't have got greedy with a hit on the ghoul. I should have just uh, pushed him away. And, uh, yeah, yeah, good point by Arrested Development. Yeah, the chance to just. He's got a reroll for all this, so it's it's probably not even that low odds. Sadly, sadly, this probably isn't even that low odds. Oh, got lucky. <laughs> Less worth because region, yeah, of course. But still, some 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 chance is better than no chance, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, block. Three, four, five, no, no. Greed is good. Greed is right. Greed. Yeah, I, I knew it was 1016, but I was like, you know, it's. It is a one in twelve nine six. If I hadn't didn't have a real, I wouldn't have. I wouldn't have dreamt of doing it, but um. You know, might have got might have got the Kaz SPP. Um, it wasn't it wasn't ludicrous. I hate that that you have to do this because you know he might go for a one turn. Oh. I can say GG. That might encourage him to not try the one time. He probably wasn't that, that that low odds there, was he? What was the what was the odds of that? Let's sunder it. <laughs> yeah, it's fair enough. It's it, you know, it's fair enough. There was certainly an argument with it being turn sixteen. I can't remove him for the second half. Right, it's a lot worse making those blocks in the second half for sure. Um, right, let's summer it up. What was that? He was a 4 plus dodge, another 4 plus dodge, a 3 plus dodge, two GFIs, and then a 4 plus to power, wasn't he? Oh, no, 5 plus to power. Um, he was 12, 13% with a reroll. 1 in 7 ish. That's, you know, that shouldn't be that easy, should it, with Agility 3 without dodge? Crazy. It's crazy how, like, how not safe things. That you think should be like how all these crazy, you know, especially elf bullshit, but even human bullshit, it's never as low odds as you think it is, unless it's without reroll in it. But the, the you know, the reroll improves all those kinds of things by a hell of a lot. So, yeah, maybe I should have, uh, maybe I should have liked double screen or something. But I guess that was weak play. Giving it all to win. I mean, I think if it was the finals of Champs Ladder, maybe I would have concentrated more on protecting the ball. But on the other hand, you still want to protect your team, don't you? So maybe not. Toast. Wrecked. He's broken armor a fair amount this game, hasn't he? I'm not, I'm not whining about it, but uh, I, I, I was obviously luckier overall with the uh, removals, but still, well, maybe he's not. Maybe I wasn't luckier. Kind of feels like I was when he gave up the surfs, didn't he? He did give up the surfs. Have you seen the growler? 
Always reminds me of Bo Selector when, when someone's called Growler. <laughs> this is the fun team, Squirrel Dude. <laughs> Chasing Davos for that. <laughs> no, no, it's just it was just literally, you know, the Skaven were dead. Um, I want to play two more games for the day. I like Dark Elves. Let's have a couple of games of Dark Elves, and then you know, see what happens. Apple first. At least he ran randomly skilled up. That was pretty lucky, wasn't it? Dodge, obviously. Don't need to think about that at all. Um, yeah, she does a thumbs down because for the other team rather than Jimmy, fantastic. Yep, that's it. That's the one. That's the one. Oh god, it's extreme light here, isn't it? Um, and there are playoff games that I could show. Yeah, Stride DK, but not the biggest one. I don't know when the biggest one's happening. Um. But I've played. I've played three games now. Did I do Stay Fantastic there? I don't even know. I don't even know if I've done Stay Fantastic. But there you go. That was a that was a dodge blitzer. Win won the first game. Thought it went okay. I don't know. Maybe I could have done some things differently. I think guess I should have gone for the not blitzing. I should have blitzed the wolf with block and and shut down the score. I guess was the safer play than than going for the greedy blitz. But you know, I did want to I did want to surf him. So there you go. All right. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic.